Superstar and Roots. This man, do not count him out. This showman has come alive. This show is a part of a brand new show that's being done for Broadway. Can yes, it's, it, it, the, the name of the show is The Last of the Show. Okay. And this is sort of a tribute. It's going to be a little bit of my life and my people who've touched my life. But the show itself is going to be broader. And it's going to get into more depth and more monologues and, and more songs and stories uh, about you know these people and about my life. And uh, you know, you understand something. When I look around the playing field. Um, it, there, there's no one out there who does what we do to do it. You know, Sammy's gone, Greg Hines is gone, you know, Frank, all those guys are gone. Uh, and I'm very grateful that I had them in my life. Today you got Cheetah, you got Liza, they're doing it. Joel is not doing it anymore, really. really. So we thank, love you, Joel. And he's, he's, but he's still, still singing and dancing. But he's not here doing what I do. So we're doing this tribute to, to those people and thanking them for, for coming this way and laying the legacy for the young people to stand upon. Young people got to know whose backs they're standing when they get into this business. They don't have no idea. They think they can go, you know, turn on MTV and they can go to Ross, make a CD, and boom, they're going to be and it's a No, it takes work and work and devotion and dedication. And you've got to remember that. So, we, you know, we're going to start, I'm not preaching at them, no, but I'm, I'm informing them. Who inspires you? <laughs> no, really. so, so you seriously, in fact, my audience inspires me. In fact, you come out. Man, that, that, that fills my eyes. Oh, tear up. It fills me up. Your musical style and what, I, what we saw today is very reminiscent of Lila Shefran, it's very reminiscent of the scat greats of the late. Where do you come with each song? How do you get where you're going to go with the song? It all, it all depends on the audience and how I feel inside. Where does the song fit me? Where does this song live inside me? Where does that lyric live inside of me that I can hang something on a feeling or emotion? And that's where I come from. You look amazing. What are your health uh, tips for our audience? I'm, I'm living with diabetes. No, you don't have to go out and get diabetes. <laughs> like, please, don't do that. Don't do that. But um, uh, I don't know. I, you know, I try to take care of myself. You know, I, you know, I eat. I eat properly for myself. You know, I'm a vegetarian, vegan, and moving to vegan. And uh, that's healthy for me. I exercise. And I go to. I still go to Luigi's dance class. You know, um, he's my he's my way show. My teacher, Luigi's like almost 88 years old. And I go to Luigi. He says never stop moving. I just came from his class. He looks great, by the way. And uh, so you know, that's my inspiration. What is the one thing you would love audiences to know about him? There's a song we used to sing in church. If I could help somebody. As I travel along my way, then my living shall not be in vain. So come out the road in some way, inspire you, make you feel good. May I just ask you one question? Yes. How old were you when you knew this is what you had to do? I'm still trying to find out if this is what I want to do. 